Alright guys, so today I'm going to be going from noob to max level with the new Awakened Doe in King Legacy. But yeah guys, before starting this video, I do want to say that I am very, very close to 40,000 subscribers. So if you are new around here, make sure you smash that subscribe button. But yeah guys, get straight into the video. And King Legacy has finally came out with another update and guess what? It is Awakened Doe. So today we're going to be doing a Noob to Max with Awakened Doe. Doe is one of my favorite fruits in One Piece in general and I've already made a Noob to Max with the original Doe. Make sure you check it out if you haven't already but today we're going to be doing it with the Awakened Doe. So first of all, we can't really Awaken Doe until we get the second C. So I won't be showing a lot of their C or the old Doe because I know a lot of you guys are here for the Awakened Doe only. So first step is to actually get the Doe in my account. So I would be buying it with Robux here as you can see uh, i'm not gonna get this bundle i don't really need permanent gate even though gate is a really really op fruit we're going to be going straight into here into permanent fruits and scrolling all the way down and this is door right here we're going to be gifting it to myself from my main account because i have all my robux there and uh, let me just do that really quick okay here i am on my main account here so we're going to be gifting it so permanent door let's give okay there we go we're going to be gifting it okay there we go i gifted it i also want to gift some two times exp okay so this 24 hour one should be enough so let's gift that even though it is a a lot of money here oh boy okay and there we go so we've done all the giving robux away part we don't really need to get anything else from the shop okay so let's check our inventory here okay there we go purple the door we will need to use two more doors later to actually awaken the fruit but let's check here shop go all the way down and we can just equip it right and equip there we go so that's the first part of the video complete we managed to get dough we're gonna need to max it out of course to actually see what the moves look like but i know a lot of you guys have already seen all the moves but yeah let's start leveling up here straight away okay let's start off by doing this quest okay there we go four soldiers oh they changed this yo i have not seen this before but there we go we one shot them and we leveled up a pretty decent amount we need to equip the two times the xp i don't know what i'm doing to be honest let's do it there we go so we got the 24 hours of two times the xp which should be enough to get me to the end of the video but we'll just see we might have to buy some more later okay let's kill all these guys there we go now we can move over to the next quest but yeah as i was saying i won't be showing much of the first c so maybe like only four to five minutes maybe even seven minutes of the video if that uh, i'm probably gonna show like me going to every island and that's about it because i know a lot of you guys are here for awakened doll so with that being said let's quickly skip over the first island okay with that we should be able to get our next move so let's check here 21 skill points and we got heat shot so let's try our heat shot here against this guy i already managed to get the sword as a drop from smokey so that's pretty nice even though i won't be using it but heat shot yeah this move is actually pretty good it has a lot of range and it's fast to use so it's pretty good it should help me out a lot whilst leveling up hella quickly but there we go this should be it okay there we go that's it now we can move over to the next island which is all the way over there okay i'm gonna be honest i don't know when they changed all these islands but all these islands look hella different to me last time i played was around the toy update so maybe i'm tripping but all these mobs are like very close to each other now so this is gonna be just easier for me i guess but there we go that's the first quest completed this island so yeah i'm gonna just complete this whole island and i'm gonna be right back okay we're going to be unlocking our next move here so let's quickly equip it there we go door spin door spin is kind of useless doesn't even really do much all it does all it does is just give me a little bit of movement does it even do damage oh it does do damage okay never mind i'm tripping but yeah i'm pretty sure now we can move over to the next quest which is all the way over there so let's make our way there okay we've arrived here at the next island but yeah, has this island also changed oh it has okay i'm gonna be honest them oh no 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 why is that guy here i actually can't wait till i get liquid drops that's what's gonna really help me out with like fighting multiple people but there we go the captain died i didn't want to fight the captain but he was here for some reason so let's kill this one guy oh i died okay and this guy should be dead and there we go okay so i'm gonna just come back here when i complete this island yeah i should be able to get the next move here after this and after getting this move i'm only going to be coming back when i get the moves because i don't want to be showing too much of first like i was saying at the start of the video but do we have it oh no literally one more quest oh that's annoying all right let's do that one more quest and uh, one more heat shot should do it there we go okay now we've got the move 100 percent okay liquid drops okay we can also move over to the next island so let's just move over straight away normally i would have stayed at this island for a little bit longer but because they did change the islands oh you can use liquid dough to go on yo this is perfect i mean you can use dough spin not liquid dough sorry but let's see have they changed this island oh yes they have perfect so this is the boss yeah okay 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 yeah them changing the island just made this game 10 times better in my opinion okay let's check out liquid drops will they just catch everyone out oh no it doesn't okay so we're just gonna have to go around in circles getting all of them like this and then now we can kill them all oh wow okay they have long range attacks okay so this is gonna be a little bit harder than 
I expected, but we should be able to do it. So yeah, I'm gonna just come back here when I get my next move, which is going to be rock punches, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, I'll be right back as soon as I get 1,000 skill points. Okay, this should be the last quest, and we can unlock our next move. I can't lie, this island, I used to hate it so much, but now it's actually very, very good. I love this island now, because it's super quick to get the levels. Every NPC is super close, as you can see. All the NPCs are here, very close to each other. You can get them very, very easily. But there we go, rapid punches. This is amazing. This move is like one of my favorite moves in the game. Very, very powerful, very, very quick. Uh, but as soon as you land him in this, it's GG. You can just kill him. Yep, this move is amazing. Especially if you have hacky, it looks even better. But yeah, especially in PvP. That, that move in PvP is something else. Oh god, that move in PvP is so annoying to fight against. Holy. I can't wait to see what it looks like in V2. I'm actually so excited to see what V2 looks like. Uh, I don't know if you guys are excited as well. But there we go. Now we can move over to the next quest. Okay, this guy here. He's a little bit far, but because we have a uh, door spin, it shouldn't be too bad. There we go. Yeah, this move now completes basically nearly completes my whole build. And yeah, door spin, I can just run back. Hopefully, I didn't aggro that guy. I did aggro him. But yeah, I'm just keep going here and I'm gonna come back when we're unlocking our next move. Okay, this should be the last quest and we can get our final move of door, which is perfect. So now we can actually use our whole kit properly. But so far, it's been very, very easy. Doors are very overpowered through. But there we go. Okay, we got a sharpened spike. We're going to be checking it out right now. I actually forgot what it does even though I've waited in like a similar video to this but without awakened door What does this do? I forgot. Oh, I remember this move. Okay, okay, okay. I remember this move It's kind of bad right now because I didn't use liquid drops Liquid drops is very very important to use it with that move like you kind of have to use it with that move But I'm pretty sure if I use liquid drops with it, it should be perfect So let's see our liquid drop and then use it. Yeah, there we go. Now it's perfect But of course they will be closer together uh, That's how you should do it and this move has actually been really helpful I can't lie with picking off all these people here and I can make my way back but let's do the actual thing properly here normally i would collect all these guys up with door spins so go around i can't get hit move around okay use this use this and then use this yeah this is gonna be very very easy but now i'm gonna just keep leveling up here and i'm gonna just come back when i hit level 1000 and there we go we finally managed to reach level 1100 there that did not take that long to be honest it took me around i want to say an hour and a half but i think i could have gone a little bit faster and it should get a lot faster now because i have all my moves set but let's make our way now to the next quest is it yeah it's all the way over there what island is this i actually don't remember what island this is but we're gonna find out any second now oh no this is the bubble island i'm pretty sure is it bubble island if it's bubble island we can finally buy haki which is gonna make no complete it's gonna make dough very very powerful so let's see i think it is bubble island yeah it is bubble island but all we're gonna do now is literally just repeat everything we've done 4.5 times more so four times and a little bit more but where is this guy okay skill trainer there we go let's talk to him yes i want to learn it so if we press is it k or is it j I forgot what button it was i'm gonna be honest oh it was t I'm, I'm stupid okay so let's check out how a door looks now even though a lot of you guys probably already know what it looks like okay this guy right here is these guys so let's collect them all up and then if i use rapid punches yeah you can see they do a lot more damage now which is extremely good so let's pop this into this and they will die there we go but i'm gonna just keep going here and i'm gonna keep coming back every 500 levels okay this should be the last quest before we have to move islands and also reach level 1500 which is actually pretty good we're actually at a very good pace right now i can't wait till i evolve this through i'm actually really really excited uh it's just uh it's just gonna change you up a little bit because uh i'm kind of getting bored of the normal door right now but as soon as we evolve it it should be a lot better but I'm, i said it once before but i'm gonna say it once again this new island layouts are 10 times better a million times better than the old layouts the old layouts were super long for no reason okay this should be the last quest that we can get to level 2000 okay this has taken four hours so far so around eight hours to around maybe even nine i'd say 10 hour push because we have to do all the extra stuff but i think 10 hours we should complete this but there we go we managed to reach level 2000 oh boy that took a decent while but you know what? i'm really happy that we got there but now we're moving over to the final island and see one then after that we can finally awaken though so let's make our way to that island okay we're finally here the last quest and then we can move over to second c where we can awaken our door fruit i still haven't seen a single video on the door fruit except the trailer and i didn't even watch the whole trailer as soon as i seen door was like gonna be an awakened fruit i straight away closed that off because i want to get my actual reaction to it because i'm really excited but there we go we can go over the second c i'm pretty sure if i press this it will take me back please okay it took me home uh okay what well, and is right there so we might as well just go to it here we've arrived here let's talk to the traveler okay there we go accept and there we go we have to bring him a map so we have to make our way back to that island over there okay we've arrived here so we just have to fight the boss over and over until he drops the map i don't think the map is that rare of a drop so we're going to be finding out here okay this should be the last hit come on first time okay we got on the demon trident oh no we got it oh what we got the map already okay 
first try? Yo, I didn't even see that. Okay, let's go back to the war, uh, the war island. Yo, the map looks so clean, but we do need a lot of these fresh fish. I'm pretty sure we have enough. I'm hoping we have enough because we need to use them uh, for later to get into third sea. Okay, yeah, we've made it. So let's talk to the traveler. Okay, thank you so much. Now you can go talk with the elite pirate to take you to second sea. There we go. Okay, we can now, I'm pretty sure, just press home and it should teleport us to the star island and we can finally go and evolve though. Oh my god. Okay, let's talk to him here and take me to second sea. Okay, I'm gonna be real. I am not wasting any time. We're going straight to the guy. So he's this way. So yeah, I'm gonna just come back when I get to him. And he's right here. Okay, awaken master. Let's talk to him. Bring me fruit similar to your power to fill the frame behind me. Then let's talk again. Okay, let me quickly go get my two doors from my main account. Okay, there we go. We got both the doors here. You need two doors now instead of, I don't even know how many before uh, for legendary fruits. I don't think there is any legendary fruit awakenings, but before you need multiple of the same fruit, maybe I think just one, but there we go. We got both the doors. So let's quickly pull it out. Interact. That's one out of two. Okay. And come on. There we go. Okay. Let's talk to him. Your power already awakened. Do you want to unlock it? Oh my God. We're here. Okay. So I need to calculate how many gems we actually need so that I can buy it. How expensive are the gems? Don't be too expensive, please. Come on. Let's see. Oh, this is going to be so expensive. Oh my. Okay, I'm back here with enough gems. That hurt the bank a lot. But let's quickly buy all these moves. Come on. There we go. All of them. Equip them. I can't wait to see this fruit, man. Oh my god. Okay, let's start off here with the first move. Spike Spiral. Because I'm pretty sure that's going to be this movement move. Let's use it. Oh my god. Yo, it's so fast. Oh, we can climb over walls now? Yo, that is OP. Yo, this movement is so good. It's not OP, but you know what I mean? Like, compared to before. Yeah, this is a night and day difference. I'm actually so excited to see what these moves do okay let's go to our first go oh and it doesn't attack at the end okay that's nice okay let's go find our first quest here let's test it out okay beast pirates okay let's start off with bouncy fist what does bouncy fist do okay i can hold it what's it do oh yo yo and that does so much damage 7k damage and it's like basically an instant cooldown can we hold it like what happens okay yeah that's gonna be nice okay i'm liking this okay let's check out missile though what oh my god let's use it yeah that does so much 15k damage is oh that's crazy okay let's check out the third move here let's see what this does okay oh yo it does a lot more damage now and it binds them well i think it's glitched but i don't know but it should bind them let's try that again okay let's try that will it bind them yeah it does bind them okay perfect yeah it works okay let's check out sticky assault what does this do oh yeah yeah this is what i'm talking about look at that damage oh my god the last hit is like a big boy hit okay the last move is chewy's rampage what does this do oh oh they have this move in this game yeah that that's amazing this fruit is so insane so far i can't even lie but i'm loving this fruit the cooldowns are all relatively very very short Th this is probably the best fruit in the game i'm just gonna come out and say actually i don't know gate is extremely overpowered but does this okay no it doesn't take it with them it would have been so nice if we just grabbed all of them but can i just one shot with this let's see it has so much range how much damage will it do 42k basically good enough i'm gonna be honest and i can just one shot them with that yeah a week though is crazy let's see does this look nice oh my god that looks insane holy yeah that's insane oh all these moves are so good bro i did not think they were gonna cook like that oh oh my god i oh, i know i'm glazing so much but i'm gonna be honest i love king legacy king legacy was my first uh one piece game on roblox so it just has like a special place in my heart i know a lot of you guys understand i've never played blocks i played king legacy more i just like the grinding aspect of uh, king legacy a lot more because blocks i'm gonna be real bro i'm not spending two weeks to max out but this I, i've always been like maybe five hours maybe six hours and i'm already second c it's just a lot more smoother progression in my opinion but yeah th this is crazy i'm loving this but yeah i'm gonna just keep on grinding here and i'm gonna come back when i hit level 2400 there we go we just managed to get to level 2500 which is very very good we are starting to get closer and closer to the end here we still got a long way to go do not get me wrong but i am actually loving this new door fruit it is so nice what's this x okay we're just gonna ignore it for now i guess but yeah i'm loving this new door fruit it's actually so good like they, they, they did not have to cook this hard with this fruit bro is this the first legendary awakened fruit let me know in the comments down below if it is because i don't really know but yeah this fruit is crazy it does remind me a lot of the blocks fruit variant but i mean there's not really many variants you can have the same fruit it is all inspired from one piece at the end of the day so you yeah, understand why they look somewhat similar but in my opinion actually i don't know which one's better you know what you guys decide which one do you think is better this one or the blocks fruit one i don't know i think this has its like a 
amazing part of it and blocks even has the amazing part of its own i feel like the missile door on this is just so nice to land and uh, the chewy rampage i feel like they are very very similar i don't know i think i'll go for the blocks fruit one uh bouncy fist i think king legacy i think sticky as solid king legacy i'll be honest it's so hectic and uh you can move it around and stuff even for usability it's actually really nice gluttonous bind i don't know spiral i think i like this actually i think blocks fruit one might be a little bit better i think this is a little bit too big in my opinion but it's still very nice but yeah you just let me know guys what you think of the box fruit and the king legacy variants but yeah let's just quickly finish this quest off i feel like this fruit is a lot better handling groups of people more bosses i think i killed those other guys a lot faster than i kill i, I think time it takes me to take care of one boss i can do two quests so i think i might just do the people's quest or the multi people quest i think it's just a lot better but yeah i'm gonna just come back here when i hit level 2800 let's say okay so this should be it one more quest then we can move over to a different quest giver yeah this fruit by the way insane insane fruit for doing all these missions like it's super easy to combo bosses and all that good stuff uh i'm actually very curious to see how this performs against the kraken because we have to fight the kraken to move over to third c so i think missile doll will be very very good bouncy fist i don't think will work sticky assault will be amazing for it chewy rampage is gonna be completely useless i believe but we can move to next so yeah we can but yeah it's chewy rampage i believe is gonna be useless glurness bind will be useless so two moves three moves are useless already so it's gonna be a little bit tricky to uh, do the kraken but when does this guy finish here we finish this quest at level 2800 so yeah i'm just completing this quest giver here and i'm gonna be right back okay so we just completed that quest there so we're going to be making our way to the next quest giver here let's check how many stats we have we have so many stats let's put it on to health we're about to max out our second stat or oh, are these two boss fight missions i kind of prefer especially with doe i kind of prefer fighting uh, non-boss fights i just think it's a lot better but is this guy bugged uh he might be uh yeah he's bugged okay is this guy bugged okay not bugged okay so we're gonna come fight him after we uh, get to what level is this requirement let's check oh teleports on me but let's check here okay 2900 so 50 more levels let's just kill it now just to see how easy it is to kill it because to be honest no matter what level we are we're not gonna increase damage anymore but let's trap him oh does he get trapped yeah we'll get him with this though this move is so clean man just love the animations but yeah my favorite move is sticky assault though just look at this this is just crazy like there's so much damage and uh, we can just combo up and straight away with missile actually missile does my favorite i don't even know there's a lot of moves here that i really really like and then gluttonous bind here that's didn't kill okay missile door will kill though but yeah there we go okay so i'm gonna just come back here when i hit level 2950 i think we move away from that quest but we will take this chest okay never mind we won't get that chest okay so we're finally at this quest here so we're going to be fighting petra like i said i don't think this fruit is that good for bosses so i do need to find a quest that has multiple npcs but i am liking this fruit very very much so far especially this move this move is so op look how much damage i'm doing here but we should be able to kill her very very quickly okay bouncy fist oh i missed that move what the hell all right, this should land okay there we go we managed to kill it but i'm pretty sure after this quest do we leave this island let's quickly check okay we have two missions and then we move over let me quickly check what level do we leave the third sea is it level 4000 let me check real quick okay we leave this island at level 3025 so we got a couple of more levels left exactly 100 levels so yeah i'll just get those levels real quick and i'm gonna be right back as soon as we get those levels okay i literally just got to level 3025 here so we're going to be making our way to the next island okay this is the second island of second sea the first island and first uh, the first island and second sea sorry is actually incredibly long it takes like a thousand levels just to get out of it maybe 800 levels exactly to get out of it but now we're finally moving over to the skull island so let's see if this island has changed any bit oh has it no i don't think it has yeah i think it's the exact same two quests right yeah i think it is two quests oh then with that kind wait is that side even quests yeah it's just two quests and then we can move over straight away to the next island right at level 3100 but yeah i am probably gonna be doing a massive skip here because i think this video is starting to get hella hella long so i'm probably just gonna come back uh, after completing this quest i think i'll just come back around level 3500 i think that's fair and after that we got 700 levels basically no like a thousand levels basically to get through so yeah i'm just come back here when i hit level 3500 okay so we're literally uh, one more level from hitting level 3300 but i wanted to find the door master at least a couple of times here in the video because uh, we do need to get his drop so uh, let's quickly show him that our fruit is a lot better than his he's got the trash non-awakened variant okay let's put hacking on i always forget for hacking on when i die 
but let's land this on him show him who the real door king is but i do have a crown and everything the exp crown oh he got me with it fair play but uh, uh man did more damage uh let me get him back we had to return the favor at least right another uh, missile though did that move is so op man and there we go okay we got the trident which is quite nice that's what we're going to be using for the rest of the video of course but we still need to farm him a couple more times to get his drop so yeah i'm gonna just come back here when i get his drop there we go we finally managed to get it that took so long 30 minutes of straight grinding just to get that holy okay let's equip it uh there we go five plus fruit damage and reduction fruit damage yep that will be very very helpful there we go this really much but it's uh, as long as we got the item it doesn't really matter now we're moving over to the next island i think it's the next 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 island to be honest we've been there for a decent while so let's go figure out which island it is whoa what is this passive tree let's talk this is the tree of the gods it will randomly spawn around the map every night do you wish to continue to listen to the story next the godly tree disappears when the sun rises or when a player receives a blessing from the tree after that the tree will disappear to you next you can receive blessings now and they affect the people around the tree when you receive a blessing you unlock a new function called passive do you want to receive the blessing from the godly tree when you press blessing the tree with okay blessing yo yo what is this yo unlocked pa uh, passive obtained fate book yo what is this and what passive did i unlock yo that's kind of clean wait how do i check I have no idea how to check what my passive is but i i guess wait why am i glitched all of my i'm back okay but what quest are we on now let's check are we on sally no we're on supreme uh swordsman so yeah okay no i'm not okay i'm on dark beer servants okay where are these guys oh they're right here i'm pretty sure these are them yeah this is gonna be very very easy just grab all of them like this yo i, I like that passive system i can't lie yeah how much damage are we doing yeah we're doing hella damage i can't lie yeah this could be very very easy so yeah i'm gonna just level up here i'm gonna get to like level 3 1600 and i'm gonna be right back okay we're actually one quest away so we're going to be summoning this guy here there we go we summoned him in and let's go fight him okay what the hell uh no we have to go back in we're actually super duper close here to getting to max level we need just a little bit more the thing that i'm scared about right now is just a kraken quest i don't know if i'll be able to defeat it but uh we should be able to beat kizaru i'm pretty sure this is kizaru he's the life fruit so he might as well be him uh but let's quickly finish this guy off shouldn't take too long to kill him this fruit awakened door is so op so it doesn't really matter who i'm fighting i'm gonna win each time because by the time i use the full combo the whole other combo is already reset and then uh, missile missile dough and bouncy fist have basically infinite like no cooldowns i'm gonna be real so yeah having like very very short cooldowns is a really really good thing but he should be dead any second there we go we killed him now i'm pretty sure we move over to the next island we got 400 level left we got 400 levels left to go i think we're reaching the last island right now in second c or maybe one more island. I'm pretty sure there's either one more island or it's the last island. I don't see too many islands left. No, actually, this is the last island. I'm pretty sure this is the last island. But we're going to find out in like a second anyways. Okay, yeah, this is the last island. Okay, so we've reached the last island. Let me make sure that my spawn is set. Okay, that's not where you say you spawn. Where's the guy that's... Okay, here he is. I kind of hate this bug where if you use spike spiral, sometimes it keeps you up in the sky. But all I have to do is just reuse it. Wait, is that power? Why did I think that was power? It actually might be. It does look a lot like power, but maybe I'm tripping. But we have to do six of these guys here who are these guys okay we're doing these glad years okay so this gonna take a while i'm gonna just keep leveling up here again i don't want to show too much of the boring grinding i'm gonna show all of uh, the c3 quest anyways so that's gonna make the video long enough i don't really want to make the video too long and all i'm doing is just basically one shotting these guys with one full combo as long as i don't miss the moves anyways but uh i have to kill six of them oh that's annoying okay but it doesn't really matter shouldn't take too long to complete here and yeah i think i'm just come back every 200 levels now every time i record i'm just gonna do like a 200 level skip but yeah i'm just come back when i hit level 3800 okay we're literally one more quest away from hitting level 3800 and then we actually need 200 more levels after that we have to start doing this third c quest which is actually a kind of long quest we don't have enough shark fins so we need to get some of those i don't know where i'm gonna get them from i think we'll have to go back to first c and grind up a little bit uh, i'm pretty sure you get it from first c not too sure but this boss is actually a pretty difficult boss uh, so it's gonna be kind of hard to grind this boss but you know what i'm gonna just try my best uh 200 more levels and after that we need i think 450 more levels to get to max so around 650 levels left to go which should be around an extra hour and a half maybe two at a push but i'm hoping we can complete this video pretty soon because i've been sat here for basically 12 hours uh nearly 12 hours and uh yeah i need, I need this isn't healthy i'm gonna be honest but i know a lot of you guys want to see uh this video this type of video so that's why i'm making it for you guys so yeah if you are new on here make sure you leave a like subscribe if you haven't already but let's quickly finish this boss of the flamingo you'll be dying right now i think maybe 
maybe one more hit actually let's check and there we go okay we killed him so 200 more levels to get i'm gonna get those 200 levels and we'll be right back when we're doing the third c quest okay all we've got now is just to do one more quest here and i'm gonna be doing this quest because I, I get 22 million all i need is 15 million so let's collect all these guys up and uh, i got all the things so i went back to first c got all the fresh fish got all the sea king's blood so now we should have everything that we need to actually go and go into third c and there we go talk to the squid okay perfect so we can now go to third c which is what we need so we need to go up there first we need to buy uh, that heart thing and then we have to go fight the kraken get the kraken all that good stuff so i'm pretty sure we yo what the hell <laughs> yo i think i'm <laughs> bugged what the hell okay so for the first step i'm pretty sure you just have to get this i'm hoping i'm doing this in the right order okay we got everything craft i don't want to go and grind up more uh fish so i'm hoping that we can beat it first try but now we need to go to wano i'm pretty sure so we need to figure out where that place is i think it's that island right there i believe it is so yeah let's make our way there real quick okay it should be right up here we can find the squid right yeah he's right there okay and the kraken place is right there so let's talk to him i needed to defeat kraken tentacle for me okay except and uh, let's make our way there i am really really hoping we defeat him first time i did not want to grind up the fresh fish please please anything but the fresh fish but here we are okay let's jump straight in activate haki get ready and do you want to use the heart of the sea to summon him yes there we go we spawned him in okay we need to get here straight away use this okay, let's see how much damage this would do i'm hoping it does decent damage okay i think we can do pretty decent damage okay oh this works but does it do damage that's the question okay it does everything does work which is nice let's use this let's use sticky assault okay this could be doable but i'm not liking how long it's taking maybe using this move is not such a good idea maybe using uh the missiles is just the best way to go about this and then using this you get a little bit of extra damage but is that one thingy gone no not yet okay i'm dead already oh no yo what's happening okay teleport me okay i got five minutes to do this okay, this could take a while so i will just fast forward through all of this yeah i don't see us winning this i'm gonna be honest we have a couple of seconds left and we just died yeah this is gonna be very very difficult to actually beat this and we've lost oh my god we've lost oh we've lost oh my god you know what i'm gonna just complete this and i'm gonna be right back okay this has been an amazing run so far i think we've done it i don't see us losing this i just stopped using what how long okay we have two minutes yeah we've done this i stopped using chewy rampage and only been focusing on actual moves and i've been actually staying a lot more back because i do have hella range so like whilst i'm back here okay i died but whilst i'm back there i'd use sticky assault so it would be like really really helpful but we've done this either way we could literally even chill for a minute if we wanted to and we could still win but we're going to be ending it off here just to guarantee the win also me using m1s is an important factor that i didn't use in the last fight and i think that's why we lost but yeah and this should be it we'll just end it off with every single button just spam everything and there we go we managed to get the item that we need and we got a new title kraken challenger let's make our way to the squid and we're going to be finally going to third c which means we're literally about to end the video off oh my god okay here's the squid okay yo i'm okay yeah amazing <laughs> amazing okay here we are again okay no please don't die again okay let's talk to the squid nice to meet you d want to go to third c except and teleport me in with this nice cutscene here we're going to be watching it uh, even though i've already seen this but just in case uh any of you guys haven't seen it you go into here and then you spin around for a bit but i'm gonna be honest this has been one heck of a grind i literally feel so tired been sat on my desk for 13 to 14 hours nearly oh boy i still have to edit the video and everything yeah <laughs> leave a like if you've enjoyed this video so far it really will help me out a lot but here we are in third c okay first time being in third c with this account we're going to be tracking the quest straight away do we have any stats yes we have a lot of stats put it on to sword but yeah here we are let's start with the first quest divers kill four of them are they where that guy is i'm hoping they're not oh that guy's got a weakened door too he's fighting a boss i think yeah he is oh i'm stuck where are these guys oh they're right there okay why are they so far holy all right let's check how hard these guys are to kill okay let's see if we can kill them from one combo i doubt we'll be able to oh okay we did but we missed one of course so we didn't get the quest but there we go he's dead okay this is perfect so yeah i'm just keep grinding here and you know what i'm just come back when i hit level 4200 okay this should be the last quest that we can move over i'm pretty sure but let's quickly finish this guy off shouldn't be that long but yeah oh we're literally on the last bit of like just last bit if this was a run we're literally on the last bit of a sprint but now we're moving over to the new island i'm pretty sure this is the new island they added in this uh c c3 so i'm hoping it's gonna be good but let's go check it out here for the first time i'll be showing every quest in this island because it is the last island the newest island so let's make our way there real quick i'm gonna be honest this island does not look that bad how many quests are on this island let's check okay this quest here that i'm seeing is not looking good but we 
got four quests and this should be the last quest right let's check here jungle gorilla kill five don't tell me it's these guys yeah, these are jungle apes so it's here no they're not the right ones where are these guys oh no they're so spread out why okay let's see how we're gonna do this i think we just gotta take three on at a time yeah i don't see a way of doing this comfortably so i think three at a time is good but at least it's only 25 levels so it's not bad but yeah there we go oh they're not even the right ones what okay it's these guys okay this is not a bad quest this is a perfect quest actually let me be honest very very quick yeah we can just drag all of them there's a guy putting me in pvp okay let's quickly land this oh yep i'm probably gonna be dead soon okay there we go completely dead bro what's this guy doing oh he killed me uh and i get pulled back here oh my god i'm gonna just complete that quest and i'm gonna come back when we're done with it okay this should be it right here uh come on we kill all of them and there we go okay we can move over to the next quest now let's check okay is it these guys i think it's most likely the is okay so this is another beautiful quest right okay this last island has some amazing quests very very easy for awakened though let's pick all these guys off like that and they basically all nearly die yeah just one more hit okay there we go yeah this is gonna be a perfect quest i can't lie and there we go okay we can move over to the next quest now so we've only got two quests left of this entire video so we got jungle apes which are these guys here this is gonna be one hell of a quest because it's gonna be so bad so we're gonna have to kill three at a time i think is our best option so i think we're gonna collect them up like this and then yep get them all like this and then use this and then finish them off with this okay will that finish them off yeah it does okay so we're just gonna have to keep doing that here and i'm gonna come back when we hit level 4375 and there we go okay we can move over to the final quest of the video i wish i could sound more hyped but i've literally been sat here for the past 12 to 14 hours non-stop grinding and it's a boss fight okay where is this boss gonna be is he that guy all the way over there i think he might be yeah it is okay so we're going to be fighting him oh he looks a little bit weak maybe i'm just tripping would he die from just one combo oh no he won't he needs like two three combos minimum yeah this guy's tanky oh my okay this is gonna take a while to kill him but at least we know this is gonna be the last quest of the video yo let's use this move i barely use this move it looks so clean and there we go okay we complete the quest we did this quest 45 times and we should be done so i'm just come back when we're killing him on the last time last quest of the video okay i managed to muster up some energy here because i know i can finally get off i mean, i've had a great time but the problem is just sitting here for super duper long if i was doing this over a span of a couple days this would not be that bad whatsoever but because i'm literally so tired and i want to go to sleep it is pretty draining but you know what i am really happy that we're at the end of this though has been really amazing to use i can't lie developers have cooked with this update i can't wait to see rubber if you guys want to see a new to max with rubber even though it is hurting me to say that right now if you guys do want to see that let me know in the comments down below but there we go we're gonna end it off with that okay it didn't end it off i tried to end it off in a nice way okay come on and there we go level 4400 max level oh my god but yeah guys that's gonna be for today's video i hope you enjoyed it make sure you smash like subscribe button let me know in the comments down below what you think of the new awakened though and next time i'll catch you all next time peace out